Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I unfortunately couldn't film an intro for you guys because technology got in the way, but um, here's what the look looks like and let's get started with this tutorial. All right guys, so I already have my face primed. I just used my Maybelline Baby Skin uh, Primer. I'm going in with my L'Oreal True Match Foundation with my Sigma Flat Top Kabuki to apply my foundation. I also have my eyebrows done, which I'll leave the video linked down below for you guys. Next, I'm taking Urban Decay's Eyeshadow Primer Potion and I'm applying that to my lids. Next, I'm going to be using a coal liner. This is a black coal liner by Clarins, and I'm going to put this on all over my lid, but not going past my crease. And after you have it all laid down, this really doesn't have to be super perfect. You just have to take a smudge brush and just kind of smudge everything out. It will take some time, just be patient with it. going in with a transition shade. This is by Makeup Geek and it's called Peach Smoothie and I'm just using a fluffy blending brush to apply this. Going in with a MAC 217 brush, I'm going in with another Make a Geek shade and this one's called Peacock. And I'm putting this just in my crease just so that the next shade that we'll be putting down just kind of blends in nicely and it's um, it'll just make the blending process a lot easier later. Taking any flat brush, I'm going in with the Urban Decay Electric Palette and I'm using the shade Gonzo and I'm going to be applying this all over my lid. Next, taking the same brush, going in with the same palette, I'm taking the shade Chaos. This is a really beautiful royal blue, and I'm just putting this over top of everything we just did. So kind of layering shades and colors will kind of make this royal blue pop out a lot more, and will give the eye a lot more dimension. You will get a lot of fallout with this color, so I just took a toilet paper uh, sheet or whatever and I just put it underneath. Now I'm just taking a fluffy blending brush again and I'm just buffing everything out that we just did so we don't have any harsh lines. Next we're going to conceal. I'm using my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in the shade Vanilla. Um, and I'm applying that to my under eyes and then using my finger to blend everything out. I just went in with my flat top kabuki and kind of blended the concealer in with my foundation so there's no harsh lines. Next, we're going to be using some false lashes. I'm using Velour false lashes called Lash in the City. I didn't film showing you guys how I put them on because I struggled as always. <laughs> Next, we're going to be taking any, I guess, flat brush or smudge brush and I'm taking the shade Chaos again and I'm just going underneath that on my lash line, my lower lash line. Next, I'm going to be going in with my Naked 2 palette and I'm using the shade Half Baked, which is a nice pretty gold. And I'm using a pencil brush and I'm putting this in the inner corners of my eye. So I wanted to make this a little bit more flashy and use a little bit more gold, so I'm taking a Urban Decay 
um, waterproof gold liquid liner. And I'm just going to be applying that on my lash line. I know I should have did I should have done this part before my lashes, but I decided to do this last minute. Using the same Clarins Cole pencil in black, I'm just going to use this to line my waterline. I'm going to highlight my brows because I forgot to. I'm using Shimma Shimma by Makeup Geek. Taking my small contour brush by Sigma, I'm using my Benefit Hula Bronzer to contour my cheeks, um, my forehead, and my nose. Taking a fluffy brush, I'm using this blush by Makeup Geek and it's called Bliss. It's a really nice pink and it's very light and it's pretty buildable. to highlight our cheeks I am taking my very sad and broken Becca highlighter in opal and I'm just using my ring finger to highlight my cheekbones next I'm taking this bite beauty high pigmented lip pencil in the shade Syrah I think that's how you say it. I'll leave it down below with the correct spelling and everything, but it's a really nice um, pinky, peachy, nude shade, and I think it looks so nice with the gold and blue on my eyes. All right guys, this is the final look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you found it helpful or useful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.